train you off for like, like nuclear situations? Um, I don't really think we're here. I mean, we do a, there's like a hazmat unit. Uh, I'll be looking at the stuff rolling up. I'm like, damn, I hope the firefighters train for this, man. I'll be ready. Yeah, I mean, that's a whole different level. Hey, I thought you were going to give me some hope, man. We're not really close to like a nuclear power plant like Perry, you know? Right. Well, so, uh, that fire ain't, ain't, ain't going to be able to get put out. Yeah, yeah. I don't even know how. You look at yourself. I just need to hear that, man. Hey, shalom, shalom, shalom. Hey, first and foremost, I would love to give all praises, honor, and glory uh, to the Heavenly Father and His Son, the uh, majority of the planet Earth, ignorantly cause God and Jesus Christ, uh, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rekah, Kodash. A double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who taught us this truth. Blessings and safety to the men, women, and children who believe on the name Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shah. And truth and sincerity uh, to you, I say Shalom. All right. And um, I ran into this, you know, Edomite firefighter um, at the supermarket. And, um, you know, I asked him a question. I already knew the answer to the question, but I wanted to see would he be truthful. You know, you know how these devils is, man. They're very 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 profitable man okay and um they believe in their own strength man okay uh their cardinal strength okay it's nothing spiritual about these devils man okay and um and the scriptures say uh to be cardinal minded is death man you know but you know hey i asked them about you know are there uh, are they trained for uh you know thermonuclear fire man uh, the devil said no you know, uh, that's a, that's on a whole nother level. He said he wouldn't know what to do if something like that was to happen. Okay? Which I already knew the answer. The scriptures uh, spoke about it. All right? About an uh, unquenchable fire. Okay? But I want to make mention of this, man. This is prophecy. All right? For this place to be destroyed by thermonuclear fire. Okay? The second death is fire. Okay? Uh, the, like the first death was water. The Lord brought a flood through. Or he gave us the rainbow as a covenant or, 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 or as a remembrance to him not to bring a flood upon earth again. Okay. And um, this is uh, Revelations 21 and 8. It says, but the fearful and unbelieving and the abominable and the murderers and the whoremongers and the sorcerers and the idolaters and all liars shall have their part in the lake which burneth with fire and brimstone, which is the second death, man. Okay, so how is this fire going to come? Okay, this fire is going to come by A, thermonuclear missiles, which is written in the scriptures, and I'm going to grab that. And um, B, all right, Yahweh Shine the Angels, okay, uh, by the way of uh, uh, the so-called UFOs, which we know them to be the Lord's uh, vehicles of war, okay, they're going to put the icing on the cake, man. They're going to uh, shoot concentrated fire upon this place, man, as a as a fatality, okay? And um, let's grab the book of 2nd Ezra, the 16th chapter, okay? 2nd Ezra 16 and 3. Well, I'm going to start at 4. It says, a fire is set among you, and who may quench it? Okay, this is going to be an a unquenchable fire, man. You're not going to see uh, firefighters... Uh, or a helicopter flying over the uh, over where the missiles hit, pouring buckets of water out, trying to consume the fire, man. It's an unconsumable fire, man. Matter of fact, I'm gonna skip down to 13. It says, "For strong is his right hand that beneath the bow; his arrows that he shoot are sharp, and shall not miss when they begin to be shot into the ends of the world." We all know that an actual born arrow cannot be shot into the ends of the world. Okay, from one end of the earth to the other. It's impossible. This is why they call them intercontinental ballistic missiles. Okay, because these missiles are created to jump continents, man. And the Lord said, what? I have created the waster to destroy, man. The Lord is the one who downloaded and sealed those instructions. Uh, I believe Robert Oppenheimer, <clears throat> okay, the Manhattan Project, the Lord downloaded that within these devil's mind to create these weapons of mass destruction for the end. Okay, for the end, man. Okay, 
It says, Behold, the plagues are sent and shall not return again until they come upon the earth. The fire is kindled and shall not be put out till it consume the foundation of the earth, man. Okay, this fire is going to give America a spiritual cleansing, man. And not only America, okay, anywhere that the Lord decreed for that fire to consume, okay, the Lord said, uh, his word shall not return unto him void, man. Okay. This is going to be a painful death, man. Okay. And, you know, it's also going to be judgment for you people out there that's going to take this MOTB. Okay. You're going to die. You're going to uh, burn in a lake of fire as well, man. Which America is that lake of fire. It's going to look like a big lake of fire, man. Okay. But I'm gonna close with this. Um, I'm gonna close with this Ze Zechariah. This is the book of Zechariah, uh, chapter fourteen, verse twelve. It says, "And this shall be the plague wherewith the Lord will smite all the people that have fought against Jerusalem." Okay, which Jerusalem is a people before it's a place. Okay. And um, it's not just talking about the whole uh, 12 tribes, man. It's talking about, you know, the elect, man. Okay. The believers of Yahweh, Shemi Shah, man, who have fought against us, first and foremost, these damn Edomites. Okay. The rest of you heathens and two thirds of our people as well. Okay. And it says, and this shall be the plague wherewith the Lord will smite all the people that have fought against Jerusalem. It says their flesh shall consume away while they stand upon their feet. Okay, and in order to be standing upon your feet, okay, your spirit has to still be in you, man. You have to still be alive, man. Okay, the Lord is going to uh, burn you people alive, man. Okay. It says their flesh shall consume away while they stand upon their feet and their eyes shall consume away in their holes. And their tongue shall consume away in their mouth, man. Okay? So, you know, this is going to be a painful death, man. All right? This fire is going to uh, it's, it's going to evaporate you, man. Okay? And this, and this picture right here, as you can see, uh, this is a picture of North America on fire. Okay? This is the place that's going to get it the worst, man. Babylon the Great, a.k.a. America. All right, so, hey, you know, I hope this was edifying. And, uh, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh. By Hashem, Yahweh Shai. By Hashem, Rekha, Kodash. Awah, Abah, Abah, Shalom.